So for a good majority of my past videos, I've been so on top of everything, like making a video a day in advance, getting it scheduled and shit. And now this is one of the first times in quite a while that uh, I'm now kind of slightly rushing to make a video. Well, not entirely. It's just one of the first times in a little bit that I've done like a same day record and same day upload kind of thing. Because uh, over the past little while, it's always been dark in my room because I've been recording the videos at night and now it's bright as fuck outside and the sun is beating down on my window. Well, actually, maybe I should have like some light in here. So I, I don't know. I actually get some sort of form of sunlight because we all know I don't go outside. Oh, nice, and Mitch is in this game. He's gonna plus 70 me. Fantastic. So anyways, now there is a reason as to why I'm so late with the uh, with the video today, and that's because, uh, once again, I've been dealing with a whole bunch of shit with my schooling and uh, registering for classes and all that kind of shit that's been going on. And unfortunately enough, I still don't even know exactly, like, uh, what's gonna be going on. Wait, this guy's saying, OMG, Rick's Quay. Hit a plus 60 today, please, Rick's Quay. And now Mitch is saying hi to me. Oh god, I'm so famous. I'm so popular. Hi, oh my god. It's such a great time in Sea Forest right now, boys. All right, so anyways, back to what I was saying. Yeah, uh, all day I've just been dealing with uh, the whole class schedule thing, and I still don't even know exactly if I'm going to be able to get into uh, all of my classes for this semester. And that opportunity that I just fucked up. All right, yeah, let's just, can I just run away? Fuck's sake. So for those of you who don't know, um, I was dropped from my classes because I didn't pay on time and then I went through the whole uh, re-enrollment kind of shit that I had to do. All sorts of complicated ass shit to get re-enrolled into the classes. So I finally got that taken care of and now I'm waiting on a scholarship payment because I do have some scholarships from uh, bowling back in the day. Yes, I used to bowl. I don't really feel like talking too much about it because it's just, I, I didn't even really like it to begin with. I actually hated it for the most part. But uh, yeah, fun fact that you guys may not have known about me is that uh, I used to bowl like competitively and shit like that. I stopped in like 2012, 2013 roughly just because I fucked up my wrist really badly. I'm gonna go ahead and like mute this out. I'm gonna see if you guys can hear this shit. Yeah, that's the reason why I stopped bowling. So yeah, fact of the matter is I'm still waiting on uh, that scholarship money to get wired to the school and if it doesn't happen by tomorrow at 5 p.m. on Friday, yeah, tomorrow 5 p.m. Friday, if it doesn't happen by then, then I will uh, be once again dropped from the classes and my scholarship money and my check money that I'm paying with uh, to meet the other half. I'm paying like half and half, like uh, money out of pocket and then the scholarship money. If it doesn't get wired in time, I will be dropped once again. All of my money will be refunded and I don't know if I'll be able to even get back into the classes at that point in time. And honestly, uh, I don't know what I'm gonna do. If I can't get back into the classes, I suppose it won't be that big of a deal. I mean, it's gonna be extremely fucking annoying because college has been just a giant clusterfuck for me. So now, for those of you who aren't in college or uh, university, really, whatever you call it, depending on where you are, most of the time, I don't know how it goes for all schools, but uh, nice flashbang. But uh, you do get these advisors that are supposed to advise you through your time at college. And I have never had an advisor. I've had some advisors that have been appointed to me, but uh, both of the advisors that I had either A, left, or B, did not respond to any of my emails. So basically throughout my entire time at college, I've had no guidance on uh, what to do, what classes to take, all sorts of shit like that. And every single time that I would um, go and talk to an advisor of some sort, I would always end up talking to a different one and they would always give me different answers. So yeah, in a nutshell, college has, uh, it's been really fucking shitty for me. And if I can't get into my classes for this semester, you know what, no, those guys are going for the bog trap. I'll let them do their thing. So uh, yeah, I mean, if I can't get into my classes, I suppose I'll just uh, go fuck myself for this semester and just uh, pick up a second job because I have applied for another job now. This whole thing has been so honest to God frustrating and I don't really mean to keep bringing this up in video after video but at the same time I like to keep you guys updated as to uh, what's going on with my life. All right hold on real quick what uh, what team is Mitch on? Okay he's on SAS? Okay I'm not trying to get clipped. All right you know is it bad that I kind of do that thing? Like if I see uh, I don't know for example Mitch you know just a really really good PC sniper. If I see somebody that's just insanely good in general and I'm slightly intimidated by them then I'm gonna get clipped by them. I'll join their team so I don't have to run that risk. Why do- why do I always do this? Fuck's sake! I could have easily killed that guy and then I probably could have gone on. No, actually, no, I wouldn't have. This is me we're talking about here. Still, though, the fucking opportunity and just the fact that I always do that thing where I scope in, but just don't shoot for whatever fucking reason. Honestly, though, the amount of plus 40s that I have missed because of that shit. Before anyone says anything and makes fun of me for my plus 40s in this current year, trust me, I, I understand. I'm sorry. Okay, wait a second. Hold on. All right, there's Mitch. I'm gonna try and follow him and uh, copy exactly what he does, and then maybe I'll be able to hit some clips. All right. I'm liking the form. Oh, yeah, really liking the form. All right, I'm gonna pick up his Barrett, and now I have the power of raw Mitch within me. No, I don't. No! Fuck you! I was gonna be a fucking scumbag and throw a stun and try and hit a plus 40 or plus 50 right there, but there's always the one motherfucker that just has to kill me. Fuck you, dude. I really overthink everything when it comes to hitting clips. I mean, like, I try and do all the most tactical shit, like flanking and all sorts of other stuff like that. And honestly, it really just never works for me. And in, like, the slight times that it actually does, it doesn't even matter because I end up missing the clip anyway.
NOT GONNA BREAK MY KEYBOARD! This is what I'm talking about, like, I don't understand how everyone does this so fucking easily. I mean, I'm just straight shit. It's fucking pathetic, dude. It's actually fucking saddening because I go to the same spots as everybody else and I just get fucked all the goddamn time. As far as, like, clips and shit goes, I really don't even know why I try, like, honestly. That's it. I'm not even gonna fucking play the rest. GODDAMN GAME! FUCK! I give up. You know what? I'm so debating taking out the fucking clan tag because there's no goddamn point for me anymore.